Right now, here at the KSYM student studios, it's presently 9.08 p.m. and 91 degrees outside. Tonight is going to be isolated showers with partly cloudy with a low around 77 and east winds 5 to 15 miles an hour. Tomorrow, we're going to have isolated showers before 8 a.m., then a slight chance of showers and thunderstorms after 2. Mostly sunny and hot with a high near 97. And south winds, 5 miles an hour, becoming calm. All right, tomorrow night we got a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms, partly cloudy with a low around 77. And south to southeast winds, 5 miles an hour. All right, all of us here at Alamo Community Colleges would like to remind all students to be safe while walking on campus. Through campus parking lots and students should be aware of their surroundings. At night, use the buddy system when walking to your car. Students who are alone and need an escort to their vehicle can call campus police at 485-0099. All right, here, hmm, here in the KSYM studios, I have Hod with me and Actually, only these two mics are going to be working right now. I should have checked that before we got on air. My uh, bad guy. But you, you can huddle close, you know. I'm not getting that close to being Y'all are buddies, right? Go get some sandwiches, buddy. <laughs> um, how y'all guys doing this evening? All right. All right. Y'all want to take a quick minute and introduce yourself so people aren't what, blindly listening to voices? All right. Well, the ugly guy to the left of me is Trans Am. He plays bass. The uglier guy behind him is Danny Blackwolf. He plays guitar. And the even uglier guy to the right of Danny Blackwolf is Dell. I almost dropped All right. that bomb there. <laughs> <laughs> That's Dell, the entity. The he entity? likes to uh, molest breast and invisibility. <laughs> and to the right of me is Carl Necron on guitars. I'm Vladimir Reeves. I do vocals. Awesome. I get drunk and yell at you. At me? No, well, <laughs> in a few Anyone minutes. in the vicinity. Anyone, yeah. Awesome. Awesome. So uh, your band is Hod, right? Correct. All right. And for those who aren't familiar with you, uh, do you do all genres of music? You want to let us know what we're going to be listening to? What kind of music? You're going to listen to a genre of metal that starts with an F and ends with an apostrophe. <laughs> <laughs> and um, it's going to kick all types of body parts I'm not allowed to say on the air. Awesome. Yes, it is. I awesome. <laughs> all right. <laughs> um, so how did y'all guys, like, how long have y'all been playing together? Uh, the first official full group gathering of the original lineup was in February of 2007. Yeah. Uh, For it, those of you who can't do math, that's six years ago. <laughs> I can normally do math. Uh, Carl had start, uh, Carl had got together with uh, the other original guitarist at the time, uh, and uh, they decided that they had some riffs and songs put together. They wanted to try to put together a band, and they individually contacted Carl, contacted myself, thinking I would fit the job properly, and uh, the other guitar player contacted the original uh, drummer, thinking that you know this guy had the talent and he wasn't doing anything, so why the hell not? And, uh, I happened to be living with the original bass player at the time. Package and, deal. Yeah, it was a package deal. Everything kind of came together, and uh, Aww, that cute. was that. You know, beers were had, shots were taken, metal was made. Aww. And many years later, and now you're too, on live too many on lineup changes later, we are, uh, <laughs> we are where we're at. Awesome. So. Um, so, um, for those uh, out there that haven't heard y'all, where can they find your music if they do like what they hear? Um, we had a, a full-length release in 2009 on Ibex Moon Records called Serpent, which you can still find. Um, some copies through some distro, some stores may not have them independently. We have them at Hogwild Records here in town, if you need some. One of the last few stores that actually has copies of that is out of print, so whatever's out there is out there. Um, <clears throat> we have a band camp that also has our stuff. All the, stuff's on Devil, band yeah. Camp. Yeah. all the stuff's on Bandcamp. Uh, we have uh, some songs on a. You can contact Oshuary Industries out of Houston, which has three exclusive songs on a compilation that we did for those guys. Limb Splitter 2 Comp. Limb Splitter 2 Comp. Uh, Limb with some Splitter other 2 Comp. Texas bands, and then one band Sounds out of cool. Virginia, some friends of ours, Lacusta. And um, the CD demos of the new 
for the stuff off the new album. Those are almost gone. But almost gone. Do I get almost one? gone? They were limited to a hundred, and uh, we got uh -oh. a handful left. And then, but we do have the uh, cassette version of it, limited to 125 copies that will oh, be available cassette. starting. Uh, mm. The 24th at our show, and then be available for National Cassette Day, Saturday, September 7th. Awesome. I love cassettes. Oh, yeah, cassettes are good. Cool. Yeah. They're even cheaper than vinyl. You can, yeah, they are. They are. Yeah. So. I can buy anything for a quarter, really. Yeah. I've got a couple things for a quarter I wouldn't mind returning. Oh. Well. <laughs> That's a whole other story. All right. <laughs> All right, guys. So, um, do y'all strictly do metal? Are there any other yes. genres you dabble in? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, we metal. strictly do metal. No other genres. Occasionally, a girl slips in here or there, but strictly we do metal. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do you only listen? I was to allowed metal? to say that, right? Yes. All right, because I already did. <laughs> <laughs> um, do y'all listen to anything other than metal? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, um, hardcore. Yes. Yeah, a little bit. Long answer, yes. Short answer, yes. All right. There's nothing more to that question. All right, guys. Um, so, how long have you been doing metal? How long have you been making music? Well, individually, <laughs> obviously, I guess is what you're asking, since we kind of yeah, covered individually. This with Let's try. 2007 yeah. answer. Uh, yeah, I won't be full. It's been about, I mean, for the band, I mean, obviously. No, not the band. Like, oh, oh. how long have you personally been uh, making music? Live, I mean, live I've been doing it right around 20 years. 20 years, I mean, that's a long time. Um, 20 years, over yeah. 20, 20, 20, everybody, about, everybody's so pretty do much you, nodding. Do you see Can yourself? you hear the rocks in our brains, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Can uh, you uh, see yourself doing anything else? Our ideas are getting it's shaking around here so much. <laughs> what? Um, can you, <laughs> um, do you ever see yourself doing anything other than this? Like other than Only when music? I'm in the mirror. Only in the mirror? <laughs> right. Occasionally I've been known to time travel. I wake up in the most bizarre places. I really do. All right. Carl has to save me. <laughs> just gotta go. Dan, and if it's another galaxy, then it's Danny. He's, <laughs> he's usually the closest one to me when that happens. Oh my goodness. All right. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, final, yeah, final yeah, little Dale's question. Got a taser. Who, who writes the music? Do you all collectively write your music? Uh, I've been writing it all. Lately. All of it. Yeah. So you're like the mastermind. I as in Carl. Carl's yeah. been writing. Well, mastermind. with all the lineup changes and everything that we've had, it's it's been down. I mean, Carl and I are the last two original members from the original lineup. Therefore, and, and Carl being the one that, uh, half of the ones that initiated the band in the first place, it, it only makes sense for him to, to be a writer. However, with the lineup that we have, we have a confidence in all the soldiers. They're going to start writing. And, and yeah. everyone's already started contributing to new stuff. But as far as everything that we have on the table now and that's been released and stuff that we play live, <laughs> it is all Carl's material musically. Yay, Carl. All right. Um, well, do y'all have any advice to like the young kids? I mean, we're known as a metal city. I mean, I, I yeah, quit I, being lazy. You know, play real yeah. metal. <laughs> play, play your own songs. Play yeah. your own metal. And let me tell you, nobody cares who you are. Nope. You have to make them care. This music scene is so oversaturated with garbage and stuff, and everyone's sitting there thinking <laughs> that they've done this before, they did this before, they did this. That it's bound to make this happen. No. Nobody cares. Make them care. If you want to do anything, you have to make them care. It's not going to be handed to you. And if it is, you'll be gone in two years and just be another joke. Oh, man. That's my advice. Okay. And buy us beers and shots when you see us out. <laughs> <laughs> That's the best advice. It really helps your case. For yeah. Whatever. <laughs> for whatever. Get in your good graces, right? All right, guys. So, um... We're about to send y'all over in the studio. Any final thoughts y'all want to say? And y'all have a show coming up on the 24th. Where's that at? Uh, Saturday, August. August 24th. Yeah, um, we are in August. We're um, at the Corova with our good buddies, Witchhaven, out of California, and uh, our pals from here in town, Aggravator, three other bands. It's uh, Hogwild is putting it on. It's going to be Jaime from Hogwild's birthday. He's going to be like... Um, 87 or something. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
Oh, oh no, 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 42. Oh, 42. Man. And he's single, ladies. He's single. Oh, my goodness. 87 and beard. Watch out now. And we also have no, a not show in Austin. He can't grow August a full 30th. beard. August 30th in Austin at Beerland with oh. uh, Widower. August 30th. The bass player's Leroy talking. <laughs> hey, uh, if you want to travel up to... <laughs> <laughs> go ahead. Here you go. Yeah. Right. We have a show in Austin, August 30th at Beerland with uh, Blood Royale, Widower, and Scattered Remains. Beerland? Where's that? It's on Beerland, and it's my land. Beerland? It's on 6th Street. It's on, uh, I've never been to Beerland. No, I mean, it's on Red River, not 6th Street, yeah. sorry. Uh -huh. It's on Red River. Yeah, awesome. It's on Red River in 7th. Might yeah, have to go check that out. You should have to come check it out. Yeah. <laughs> all right, guys, so uh, we're going to get you all over in the studio. You, you that makes that sound instead of the normal tap? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> all right, this is uh, Live on KSYM, and I'm Lisa Love. We'll be back in just a few moments.